Hey lovelies, welcome to this 18 minute full body yoga flow. We are going to get started by coming to a cross-legged seated position on the mat. Keeping a nice tall spine. Bring both hands forwards, interlace the fingers, push the palms away, round in the back, chin to chest. Inhale, straight spine, arms up. Elongate the spine, take a breath, and then exhale, take it over to the right side, stretching through the left side body. Release the right palm to the mat, lean over, reaching through the left hand. Breathe here. And then push yourself back up, same again. Arms go forward, interlace the hands. Palms push forward, round in the spine. Inhale, take the arms up. Take a breath here. And then exhale over to the left side. Release the left hand to the mat, reach over with the right hand. Take a breath. And release back to centre. Make your way to tabletop, placing the knees under the hips, hands under the shoulders. Take the knees as wide as the mat, toes together. Push the heels back, come into child's pose. Melt in the heart and the forehead down to the mat. Slowly round in the back, push the body forwards, drop the hips down. Option to lift the legs up, pushing the hips down to the mat. Hold it here for a breath. And then exhale, push back to child's pose. Same again. Inhale, roll forwards. Lower the hips, lift the legs up. Gazing forwards. Hold it here for a breath. And then slowly push the hips back. Nice, we go again. Rolling forward. Drop the hips, lift the chest and lift the legs. Option to drop the head back for a deeper stretch. And then release the legs down, come to tabletop. Then when you're here, we're going to extend the right leg back, point the toes. Keeping a nice straight spine. Left arm goes forwards. Try not to round the lower back. Bend the right knee, knee to elbow, round and squeeze. And release, two more, knee to elbow. And release, knee to elbow, squeeze it together. And then release the left palm down, shift the body forwards, and then with control, we're gonna bend the elbows, lower the body all the way down, chin to touch the mat, and push back up. Nice, release the right knee down. We're gonna do the same on the other side. When you're ready, left leg goes back, point the toes. Bring the right arm forwards, gazing forwards. Bend your right left knee, knee to elbow, crunch, and release. And again, crunch, round in the back, and release. One more, knee to elbow, squeeze, and release. Take the right hand down, shift the body forwards with control, bend the elbows all the way down and then pushing all the way up. Nice, release the leg down. Good job, sway the hips side to side. And then tuck your toes, push back to downward facing dog. Keeping a nice long spine, 
let's pedal the feet, pushing the heels into the mat, chest towards the thighs, releasing any tension from the neck and the shoulders. Breathe, inhale through the nose, and then exhale through the nose. The right leg high, three leg dog. Bend in the knee, looking at the foot through the left side, opening the hips. Hold it here, push into the left heel. And then step that right foot forwards outside of the hands. Option to keep the back leg lifted or lower the back knee down. Lizard. Gazing forwards. Take a nice big breath. Exhale, drop the back knee down. Pull the hips back to half split. Fold in forwards over the leg as far as you can go. Stretching through the back of the right leg. Breathe. And then push forwards. Heel toe the foot over to the middle of the mat. Then drop the hips down, turn into the left side, come to Skandasana. Keeping the left leg straight, maybe you need to come up onto your tiptoes to create more space. And breathe. Keep a nice tall spine. Maybe you need to use your hands for more balance. That's absolutely fine. Keep breathing here. And then take the hands back to the top of the mat. Push the hips up, right leg back, three leg dog. And release that leg down. Nice. Roll the body forwards, come into plank. Drop the knees, chest and chin. Push through the hands, up to up dog. And then tuck the toes, downward facing dog. Good job guys. Left leg goes high, inhale. Bend your left knee, gazing under the right armpit, looking at the foot. Pushing into the right heel. And then step the left foot forwards outside the hands. Option to keep back leg lifted or drop the knee down for lizard pose. Keep the hips nice and low, gazing forwards. If you have the back leg lifted, drop the back knee down. Pull the hips back, straighten in the left leg for half split. Breathe into the hamstring. Exhale, sink the chest down. Good, push back forwards, heel toe the foot to the middle of the mat. And then turn the hips to the right side, right leg comes straight, keeping the left knee bent. Again, maybe you need to come up to your tiptoes, use the hands, do what you have to do here. Feeling a nice stretch inside the right thigh. Breathe. Enjoy your skandhasana. And then take the hands forward, step back to plank, to downward dog. Nice. Roll the body forwards, come into plank. Drop the knees, chest and chin. Push through the hands, up to up dog. And then tuck the toes, downward facing dog. Right leg goes high. Bend the knee and step the right foot between the hands. Drop the back knee down. Low lunge, arms come up, keep the hips low, gazing forwards. Hands come down to the mat, pull the hips back, straighten in the right leg for half split. We're gonna flow between these two movements. So when you're ready, push forwards, arms up to low lunge, 
and then arms down, hips back to half split. Nice fluid movement, inhale, arms up, exhale down. Good, inhale, exhale. Nice, push forwards to low lunge, hands on the mat. Tuck the left toes, take the right leg back, lifting the right leg up, slowly chaturanga all the way down. Inhale, upward dog, and exhale, downward dog. Don't worry if you didn't get the transition, there's always next time. Left leg goes up, three leg dog, step the left foot through. Drop the back knee down, and the arms go high, low lunge. Move in between the two movements, down to half split. Inhale, arms up, hips low. Exhale, hips back, chest down. Nice, inhale. Exhale. And then push the hips forward, hands come down. Heel toe the left foot to the outside of the mat and then lift the back knee off the mat and then walk the foot to the top of the mat. We're coming to Malasana, so sinking the hips down into that deep squat position, keeping a nice long spine. Maybe you need to come up onto your tiptoes to create more space. Making sure the knees are being pushed away from each other with your elbows. Keep the chest open. Gazing forwards, breathe. Feel a nice stretch through the hips. And then take both palms down to the mat. Pull the hips up, straighten in the legs. Heel toe the feet so that they're at hip width. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, fold forwards. Chin to chest, begin to roll up. Inhale, sweep both arms up and exhale, arms beside the body. Nice. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lengthen, flat back, hands on shins. Exhale, step the right leg back. Inhale, arms up to high lunge. Hands come down, step the left leg back to plank. Shift the body forwards, knee, chest, chin. Inhale, push up to upward dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Step the right foot between the hands, arms come up, high lunge. Arms come down, step the right leg back. High plank, knee, chest, chin. Inhale, push up to up dog, strong shoulders. Exhale, pull back to child's pose, resting the hips on the heels. Take a couple of breaths here. And then slowly push yourself back up, release the legs. Shift yourself forwards, take a hold of the legs and roll down to your back. Bringing knees into chest. Let's go to happy baby. So feet go to the air, keeping the knees bent, take a hold of the feet and slowly rock from side to side, enjoying your happy baby. Release both feet, take the right ankle on top of the left thigh, Take a hold of behind the thigh and pull both legs into your chest. Feel a nice stretch through the hips. 
and release. Let's switch to the other side, left leg on top of right, pull the legs in. And then release, bring both knees into your chest, squeeze the knees, gently rock from side to side. And then release the legs down to the mat. Place the arms beside the body, palms facing up. And let all the tension in the body melt onto the mat. Close your eyes and enjoy this savasana. Begin to wriggle fingers and toes, waking the body up. Bend both knees and turn onto your left side, using your hand to push yourself up, keeping the eyes closed and meet me in an easy seated position. When you're here, take a nice big breath in and exhale, release. Hands to heart center. Namaste. I hope you enjoyed this flow. If you did, feel free to subscribe to the channel where I post videos every single day, a new flow each day. And if you want to see something more specific, feel free to comment down below. See you in the next one. Bye.